as long as you think that you could do it on your own, you're not going to give God a chance to show up in your life. Come on, if you're ready to praise Jesus, put your hands up. Sometimes you just got to do that. Pretty much look the enemy in the eye and say, sorry, I'm with him. Stick that in your pipe and smoke it. Do you know, say so you've just got to get a little sass. that no one else has to bring it. It's about God becoming bigger in our world, becoming bigger in our souls and our hearts. And as He is magnified, the things of this earth grow strangely dim. We have no time to lose our way like Alice, to fall from the path, to bump our head and bruise our soul. Our mandate is to stay the path. Who you are is a daughter of the King of Kings and nobody can touch that. God has made you for a purpose and you are in fact the only one that can fulfill that purpose. You ask today, will your dream live? Yes, your dream will live. And you've allowed that one thing, that one year, that one season to negate what Jesus Christ did that could set you free for all of eternity. Even when you can't see Him in your life, He sees you. He's calling us to Himself. If we can get ourselves near Him, then we can be set free. He found in His words, His shadow, and His footsteps. Endlessly, endlessly found. 